Good morning everyone. My name is Shyamli Dhru. I am from BJMC Civil Hospital Ahmedabad. I am here to present my paper on to study the clinical profile of children with malaria admitted to Civil Hospital Ahmedabad from January to December. Aims and objectives are to study the clinical profile of malaria in admitted patient between age group of 1 month to 12 year of age to study various clinical presentation of malaria, to study various complications of malaria and to evaluate immediate outcome of patient with malaria in terms of morbidity and mortality. Demographic distribution shows malaria is more common in lower socioeconomic class due to poor sanitation and vector control. Species of malaria may P. vivex is most common. Clinical presentation among malarial patients are mo most is fever and chills and rigors being second presentation. Complications of malaria shows organomegaly like hepatomegaly and splenomegaly, anemia, thrombocytopenia and a severe malaria. Severe malaria is classified by WHO criteria. There are 10 criteria and any one among these uh, is present. Tell it me is your, classed as severe. Tell me your findings during the study rather than the theory. Huh? What person, don't describe the, malaria, the theory of malaria. You need to pinpoint what you did in the study in the sense. What percentage was splenomegaly? What percentage was severe malaria? Okay. Splenomegaly are shown in 22.2%. 22% 22 shows splenomegaly. Okay. Anemia? Severe malaria transmitted in 5% of. Okay. How do you di did you diagnose malaria? Uh, by peripheral smear. Thick or thin? Thick. What is the other method to diagnose malaria? Hmm? Any other method you know RDT. to diagnose malaria? RDT. Repetitive RDT. Pickup. What does RDT pick up? Antibody, antigen? Antigen. Antigen. Name two, two antigens of this malaria parasite that RDT picks up. P45. No. Any newer method? She said PCR for whooping cough. Is PCR for malaria available? Yeah. PCR for malaria is available. What would you prefer? If, if given a choice, civil may everything is free. PCR is being done and after Jamai Kewe, na sir karna, badu free mara apna ya. So PCR is done and PS is done. Both are free. What picks up malaria parasite better? PS. By what percentage? PCR doesn't pick up malaria properly. PS is better. Per microliter of blood. How many parasites would be, would be picked up by PCR and how many parasites would be picked up by uh, PS? I'm taking a mi one microliter of blood. Roughly, I, I obviously, obviously no fixed figures, but what's the difference between the malaria parasite picked up by PCR versus MP picked up by PS? <coughs> PCR is better. Why did you change your mind? PCR is highly sensitive. Malaria is one exception wherein if PCR picks up one uh, MP, your PS would pick up 10. Okay. Right? So, peripheral smear is still a better investigation. PCR is still not a good investigation for uh, malaria parasite. Okay, good. And on the treatment.